Hello, Internet World. Hello, Internet World. Welcome, one and all, to the very first episode of our YouTube series, Find a Way with Orfeo and the Wrench. Find a Way with Orfeo and the Wrench. Two madmen with instruments and ideas. Although we're primarily musicians, most of all, we are a pair of entertainers. Our goal is to entertain you. With the very best in music, comedy, literature, news, discussions and debates, rants and raves, and whatever else we can bring you through a couple of cheap cameras and an internet connection. So strap in because this episode is about marijuana legalization in Colorado, which is where we are. Cannabis legalization in Colorado. Let's get three facts out of the way. Fact one, Colorado voters legalized recreational marijuana in Colorado in 2012. Fact two, the Department of Justice, the feds, you might say, is not going to interfere with state law unless it infringes on eight points. Preventing the distribution of marijuana to minors. Makes sense. Preventing revenue from the sale of marijuana from going to criminal enterprises. Uh, preventing the diversion of marijuana sales to other states. So if there's interstate trafficking to be used as a cover or, prefix for, or a pretext for trafficking other illegal drugs. Preventing violence or the use of firearms along with the cultivation of marijuana. That's a good idea. Preventing drug driving. Five nanograms, I think, is a bad whatever. Preventing the growing of marijuana on public lands. And finally, preventing marijuana possession or use on federal property. Fact three is that marijuana is here. It's culturally here. I don't know. Here's a map of all of the dispensaries just in the Denver area. It's like hundreds of these. And it's it's here in printed form. I'm chronic. Also, culture. THC, the hemp connoisseur, the daily doobie, the Tommy Chong right there. If advertisements are an indicator of culture, then marijuana is already here. And nobody knows what's gonna happen. Nobody knows, really. So how do we find a way through all of this uncertainty? Nobody knows what'll happen because it's never been done before. So, well, we decided to go all in. We're gonna capitalize on Colorado cannabis consumer culture. And we started with making a video, a kick-ass video called The Devil Went Down to Denver. You can find the link below. You should watch that video. As a band, we've decided to go all in, capitalize on this movement, and come January 1st, hopefully, the band will explode. The band will explode, and legal weed will explode. Legal weed will give people the space within their minds. It will give them perspective and help them to enjoy their lives. Give them the space they need to recognize our greatness, recognize their own greatness. People will discover a newfound sense of well-being and peace and a slight hankering for nachos. So here's hoping. Thank you everyone for watching. As of Tuesday, December 10th, we are still giving away our music for free at bandcamp.com. You can find the link below. If you'd like to continue finding a way with us here, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We will be releasing new episodes every week. Barring unforeseen disaster. Every week. Barring unforeseen disaster. Every week. Godzilla says, subscribe. <laughs> <laughs>